This motherfucker, would you say I'm on my way? I'm swerving in a race on the way to the bank. Let it go, bang. What's up guys, Planet George here, back from another video, and today we're in a roller to tournament, and by popular demand, we have uh, Valve Tesla Log Bait Cycle with Skeletons. Hope you enjoyed the previous video, if you did, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already. Helps my channel grow and other log bait players to find me. And looks like we got Gombro Ice Spirit in our hand, so let's go for that. And also, comment down below what other decks I should play. Because right now I'm just waiting reason why you're not seeing too many um, ladder push videos is because I'm waiting for the mirror and the giant skeleton to get a, a nerf sometime next week in a few days. P.S. Those cards don't make log bait like viable at all. Like, it's a real struggle. But even though you have like a damage lead, for example, against like a hog mirror deck, um, I'm gonna log that magic archer. If you have like, even if, if you have a damage advantage against those decks with mirror, you can still lose. Because they just like spam you to death. Okay. Let's, do that. let's go for Ice Spirit like this. Skelly's here. Oh, let's go for Valkyrie down low here. And a log on that. Pekka and Magic Archer finishing it off. We have a really good matchup because of Tesla and Skelly's against Bridge Spam. So no excuse for me losing. However, I've been facing some Wi Fi issues lately when I was playing a little bit today. Okay, I'm trying to activate our King Jar here. If you play Princess in this position, Ice Spirit here following after it. Okay. There should be no way I could lose because King Tower is like, when you have that activated against a Bridge Spam, basically like win. If you're like even on the MPS, defense is so much easier with the King Tower up because you're going to be cutting stuff in the middle. Okay. Let's go for the Skeletons here. Kind of messed that up. That's fine. Let's go for Tesla. Let's go for a log, keeping it alive. Go for Ice Spirit, run on top of the E-Wiz. E okay. Okay, I'm gonna go on bro, Ops Lane. He's my P.E.K.K.A. In, but yeah, he's my P.E.K.K.A. there. Okay, I'm just gonna go Princess in the back here. Uh, going for Tesla again. Okay. I'm going for a log, try to reset that. Okay, so skeletons here. Gombro as well. Yeah, that bandit just died instantly because of the King Tower. And Gombro is going to be. It's going to take a lot of damage. Left alone there. Just played like a late road ghost. So I'm going to go for Valkyrie here so it doesn't get um, much archer value. Not the best fireball. Yeah, I'm just going to go in again because there's no good counter to barrel. I'm going to rocket that match archer. Hopefully, play something else. Oh, right into the Ewis as well. And that's just me, GG. Very nice game. I think that I played that pretty well. Yeah. Alright, guys. Thanks so much here against Juan Pa. So let's go for a Princess in the back here against the Flying Machine. Yeah, let's go Skeletons here. Okay. I'm just going to pressure with a Barrel and an Ice Spirit. Because he played John Skelton, and I don't want him to build a big push. He does Tornado, get the King activation, but we do um, get a lot of damage in return. Okay, let's go Tesla here for the Giant Skeleton. So I have no idea what he's playing. Okay, let's go for the Log here on the Barrel. Skeleton's here to pull it back. Okay, wow. Ice Spirit here to catch that one Goblin. Okay, I think we just took one hit from the Goblin there. It's fine. Right, it's Mirror Barrel, Giant Skeleton, and Tornado. And Mighty Miner. Yeah, I don't know why um, Supercell's being super slow of releasing new cards in the game, because that's like how they make money, and pretty much their game is dying because there's no nothing new being added. Like, this Clash Fest thing, I think, is all bullshit. Sorry for the language, but I think it's all BS, because the challenges are like one week apart, and... Once you finish a challenge, there's like not, you gotta wait a whole week for like crappy rewards besides the battle banner tokens. Like the only thing that's that I'm looking forward to is just that. So let's actually soak up that flying machine. Okay, that's a bad. 
um, back on barrel. The reason why I didn't use my log is he might mirror his gone barrel, and I just want to log that. I'm just waiting here, just playing patient. Yep, there it is. So I'm gonna go for a log here. Okay, so I'm gonna let Valk go. I'm gonna just go for a princess here, applying pressure here. And Supercell needs Clash for all developers need to like add like more new cards in the game. Okay, that's gonna be a nice rocket value and also more frequent updates. Okay, that's just my take. Okay, let's go for Ice Spirit here and Skellies. Okay, we just take one goblin hit, that's fine. It's for a Gombrel Princess. Okay, that was a really nice giant skeleton predicting their princess. Uh, once again, guys, we're running for a Tesla here for a giant skeleton. Okay, that flying machine is like really annoying. So I'm gonna go for rock here. Ooh, giant skeleton doesn't get kited over because it's annoying. Let's go for ice spirit here. Okay. I'm gonna log this barrel and then get rid of Valkyrie. Yeah, he's gonna like Gombrel again. If you play your Valk in the back quick enough, it's going to, like, kill all the goblins when it pops out. Okay, I'm just sent to the rocket cycle, but... Okay, and I'm going to do it because he has a flying machine there. It's going to die. It's going for Gombra because the Valk is tanking. Okay, first of all, Tornado. Let's go for a Princess here to snipe that. Money Miner. Uh, let's go for a Log, and then Valkyrie again. Yeah. Okay, that was a really good barrel. That was like the only good play. You might magic archer just go for a high Tesla predicting it. Oh, I'm surprised he didn't go for it. Wow. Okay, so for gone barrel again. Okay, we should get some damage here. Yeah, I think it's gonna be game. Rock and log should do like around 500 damage. Tournament standard. And GG. Right, next match here against Edwin. Galaxio. So let's go for Princess in the back here. Let's see what's up. Okay, it's going for Goblin Gang. The lost bait card that hasn't been played because it's super weak due to a lot of splash cards in the meta. Like Mother Witch, um, Skelly King. That's the reason why um, guards and skeletons are way better um, options than Goblin Gang because. Like I said earlier, there's like a bunch of splash cards in the middle. Let's go for a log here. And I think I'm going to go for Emergency Valk. Yeah. The wizard does splash into our tower, but that's fine. Ooh, he's going to go for a knight. Uh, can we go for a princess? Okay. Okay, we just got outcycled there. Interesting. It's for Valkyrie and Barrel here because he has to play log on one card. Right, he has Zap, and I think he's gonna lose his tower here. Yeah. Because he doesn't have log for some reason. Kind of odd. Okay. We go for skeletons to try to like force out another response, maybe a wizard or something. Okay. Okay, Princess arrives, that's huge. Okay, I'm gonna go for a Tesla here. Just to play on defense. Alright, I'm saving my elixir. A lot of people in this position would just go Princess of the Bridge, but I don't think it's a good play. Okay, I'm gonna rock you here. Yes, you always wanna do it when you're like really up in elixir. And you're not like forced to defend. Okay, he's gonna magnet. Now I'm gonna Princess PS, he spent a lot of elixir there. And he has to play something or Okay. Super Valkyrie here. You always want to make sure, um, force them to play their support cards in front of their Mega Knight. Okay, that was a bad Gone Barrel. It was supposed to be an Ice Spirit. Okay, kind of a sad mistake there. Let's go for Valk here. And we can log those Goblins now. Okay. Um, let's go for another Tesla on that Wizard. And Skelly's here. Princess sniped the Inferno Dragon. Okay, looking solid. Uh, let's go Ice Spirit like this. And we can rock the tower for victory. Yeah, I'm going to do it with the Mini P.E.K.K.A. there. Play in our Tesla. Goes with the Mega Knight. Let's go Valk here. Okay, he's playing his barrels all the way in the back. Kind of funny. 
Yeah, GG. Alright, so we've got Gone Barrel, Ice Spirit again. Okay, our opponent's going with Fire Spirit, so let's go Ice Spirit here. And then Gone Barrel. Okay, it's got Skeletons as well. And Valkyrie. It could be anything like Goblin Drill, Log Bait, or Expo. Okay, he's going to Princess. Let's go Princess here to snipe his Princess, going for a Log as well. Kill the Gone Barrel. Okay, let's see if the Valk makes it to a princess, but I doubt it. Yeah, we're going for a low ice spirit here because he might block the bridge or something. Okay, let's go for Gone Barrel to cycle here because he did use his log earlier, so he should get some damage. Okay, really good fire spirit push by him. Okay, let's go Valk right here. And skeletons, if you're not fast enough with the Valk down in tower, you can go in that position plus skeletons like. Full counter to barrel. Let's go for princess. Try to like kill the cannon so the Valk stays alive. Okay, let's go for a log in that. Um, princess. Okay, force out the Valk was down. Ooh, I'm actually gonna go for a gone barrel like this. You see, he's gonna do the fire spirit push. Yeah, you play your goblins in the front. You get three hits guaranteed if they try to do that. Okay, you might do the same against me. So to watch out. Okay, I think that's yeah, that's gonna be on the side. Okay, we're going to take one hit. Let's go Princess here to apply pressure. He's not going to expect it. Okay, that was a horrible cannon. He has to play something else. Okay, on top of that, Princess gets hit. Okay, I'm going to go for like a high Tessa to try to predict his Princess. Because that's like the only thing he can do, really. Okay, I'm going to go for Tessa now. Yeah, I'm going to go for Rocket Barrel because it's only... Defense, never mind. I'm gonna go for rocket on the princess. He gave it too much rocket value there. Okay, that kind of messed him up. And all right, he's going for a gone barrel. Okay, I was hoping for that test to kill that one goblin on the corner here with the Valk. While well, I'm hovering my Valk, that's fine. Again, he's gonna do a weird. Okay, I'm gonna go for Valk in the middle here. Going for a gone barrel again. Okay, we gotta watch out. It's a rocket here. Okay, we're gonna log. Uh, go for a princess, should have block. Ice spirit as well. Okay, um, let's go for Valkyrie like this. Gone barrel here. Okay, kinda misplaced the barrel. He's gonna kill it within a fire spirit. Never mind. Um, okay, we're gonna rocket for the win here. Yeah, that's gonna be GG. Basically, against some mirror matchups, you want to like try to predict their princess, not overprotect your princess too much, and only only want to rocket when you have log in hand. Because if you rocket without log, they can just punish you with a like, Gombro princess, and you can't defend. All right, next match here against this player. All right, immediate, um, sphere gobs and minor, by him. Now I'm gonna try to catch his bass with the ice spirit here. Okay, he goes with a log. He's playing some sort of minor wall breaker deck. And you always want to go ops lane against these. Because he just counter push you. Alright, maybe he's playing mortar with the guards. I have no idea still. Okay, Tesla's going to be good here. Alright. It's going to be sketchy. Let's go for a Valk down low. Not risking taking a mortar hit. Yeah, a mortar would have hit our tower. Let's go for a princess here applying pressure. Okay, interesting. Minor by him. Let's go for an ice spirit. Skies here. He did waste his log, which is massive, but I'd rather save my elixir and go in right away because he's probably going to expect the Gone Barrel. If he mortars again, I'm just going to rocket it because he might play like a cannon cart in front or maybe guards in front. And if your opponent um, has guards in hand, you always want to play Gone Barrel towards the side of the tower. Okay. I think he went AFK there, or yeah, that was lag, so kind of bad. But let's go for Valkyrie here, because he might play something in front. Okay. And now we're going to go for Tesla. Okay, that was a horrible minor. Yeah, I want to punch him with the Princess to Bridge here. Okay, that log was horrible as well. Gets over Gombrel. He's at zero right now, and yeah, he's going to have a tough time def defending it. 
All right, that's rocket range. And just set up a defense for the next minute, and we should be fine. Just set to watch out for his dark goblin and cannon cart. And that's about it. And maybe he has minion horde as his, like, trap card. Okay, I'm going to rock it now. Okay, that was actually bad timing because he's still out of defend this. And it kind of gets sketchy if you, like, rock it naked. We should be fine. Yep, there's a king card. I'm going to go for high test of sniping it. And log here. Okay, um. Should I let that more lock on? No big deal. Like, two hits. Okay. Skeletons here. No way to miner will take our tower. Let's go for a high Tesla and Valk here to defend. Yep, log Dark Goblin, and there's no way he's going to break through. Skeletons to cycle, and just in case he wants a miner. Yep. And a nice spirit here, and it should be a game. Okay, I don't know why I'm just playing my Gombrels randomly. Like, I'm just, like, spamming cards. Not looking. That's, like, I think it's because, like, my fingers are kind of too big for the screen. I should really get a new device, guys, because I've been misclicking a lot lately. Even though I had this phone for like two years. Don't got a license. Supermodel sliding through the Cali Hills. Mesmerizing the horizon.